So we have here a uh, underground support trailer. You can use it for actually a lot of different things, but uh, meant for phone companies to do underground utility work. Uh, it's a 12 and a half kW generator. We have a blower here for ventilating manholes, heating up houses, um, been used for a number of different purposes. Uh, we have a four cylinder air compressor back here, uh, actually two air compressors, each one has uh, uh, two cylinders on it. Air dryer, we have tool oiler, we have dry air, um, we have a uh, aero board there. This is a propane generator, uh, runs on propane tanks. You can put a bigger one like this. You can buy the littler ones at Home Depot. Uh, has hydraulic surge brakes on it. Um, this is the auxiliary air tank for the air compressors. Uh, if you come to the back here, we have our control panel. We have high pressure air, low pressure air, we have all of our gauges to uh, see what's going on. If we start the engine, uh, we'll put the main breaker on. And then we can turn on the air compressors. We could turn on the air dryer if we want. Activate uh, all of these uh, 220 and 110 volt outlets. Here's a remote for the one outlet. So there is a pump over here that if you wanted to put that in the manhole because there was water in it, you want to put it in your basement because it flooded, it'll pump that out. And it's 220 volt and it really uh, kicks. That is right here. Um, and it works fantastic. This here uh, is storage. I'll show you quickly underneath there. We have bottle heaters in here. If you were to go ahead and I uh, want to operate this in extremely cold weather, bottle heaters for the propane. Um, and any anything else you'd like to put in there. Uh, this will hold uh, floodlights up here if you want to put floodlights up. Um, let's go ahead and fire it up. Oh. When you go down into the manhole, this comes out, goes down into the manhole, blows either cool air you know, ambient temperature, or there's two heat settings on it where you could warm that up if it were colder outside. I've had guys that put them in houses, the warm houses up, put them underground to ventilate the manhole. But fire the engine up there, put the main on, one air compressor, second air compressor. You want to turn that blower on? If you want to put heat on, these are your uh, air dryer. You can hear the air dryer working already. And these are for all your receptacles. There's a compartment down here that runs the length of the trailer. It's for storage. Got another on-off switch there. There's a drain for the air in the front. 